Hey, good morning, YouTube. Yeah, it's Rod Harden here. It's uh, now six um, six forty in the morning. I just saw Bond's video, and yes, it is the weekend, so I do get the weekend off sometimes from a three-letter word that nobody likes to hear: J O B. All right, so I do have a J O B for those people out here that don't understand what what it means it's a job so <clears throat> but anyway I wanted to go on ahead and express uh, my congratulations to Bond that his wife his estranged wife has just returned home just saw the video on that now let's see how long it lasts because as you just saw on his other video he's already on Google Plus you know talking to all the people he deals with on Google Plus live and uh, let's see how long that lasts okay because of the simple fact once he starts getting into it and starts neglecting his wife all over again he, she's going to be out the door again so it, it's just a matter of time now one of the other things that I need to bring up and that Vaughn needs to really understand. Um, if your estranged wife was in a mental facility, I don't know whether she was or wasn't. That's, you know, um, not my uh, area where I want to go with any of this because it's not my business. But <clears throat> under the new laws that were put in place as far as gun ownership goes, it's just like having a convicted felon living under your roof. Um, you cannot possess or own a firearm in your dwelling uh, with a person that has a mental history or a criminal history. So um, I would recommend that Vaughn check his state laws to understand that. So don't think you're going to get your guns back, Vaughn. It's not going to happen. Even if you've never been convicted of any crime or been convicted of or been charged with some kind of mental disability, which a lot of that's sometimes questionable, um, you know, like I said, uh, you will not be able to possess or own a firearm in your dwelling. So, uh, you know, I, like I said, congratulations, Vaughn. You know, see how long this works out. You need to get your head out of YouTube and you need to get your head out of the uh, Google Plus um, Live in order to uh, work on your relationship with your uh, estranged wife if you intend to keep her around. Now, from your past uh, comments where you stated that she had violent tendencies against children and stuff, um, that's going to keep CPS up in arms. They're going to definitely be checking on her, and they're definitely going to be checking on you and checking on the welfare of the children now with all this in play. So, um, you know, like I said, best of luck to both of you. Uh, I said my piece on this matter, and, uh, you know, <clears throat> Time can only tell people. Till next time, it's Rod Hardman. Have a safe, pleasant day.